and also what did you have any thoughts on the Manny Pacquiao Tim Bradley fight uh, how, what did you think when you uh, you saw that fight well you know I thought Pacquiao won but uh, honestly it was just one of those fights that a lot of people don't really know about it just it happens I guess I don't know uh, since I said it happens, people are going to talk shit about me now about yeah. that brew fight. So it, yeah. there's no comment really. I don't even know how to say anything about it because I'll get negativity back from mm -hmm. my last performance. So it's like, I'll leave it as it is. It happened, it happened. And, you know, the general public, whenever a fight happens, say a fighter looks great, they'll really jump. You know, general public, if a fighter looks great, you know, they might jump on his bandwagon. If the performance isn't what they expected, do you feel they're a little too quick to throw the fighter under the bus? I mean, what That's do you... how it is with all the critics out there. All these fuckers don't even know shit about boxing. <laughs> Just because they've been watching it for a certain amount of years, they're experts. So that makes me a fucking Einstein. I've been boxing since I was eight years old, so I'm a fucking Einstein now when it comes to boxing. All these fuckers are just too critics about... They just want to label somebody right away. Oh, man, he's doing good. He looked great, blah, blah, blah. One bad performance. Oh, he ain't shit. He ain't going to be nothing. Uh, he just won uh, one type of fighter. He's just a forward fighter. That's it. He he, he hits a lot. Blah, blah, blah. They, you know, they talk kind of shit. So you can't let those things, those guys get to you because they don't even know what the fuck they talk about themselves. So I don't even worry about them. Now they were talking about Manny Pacquiao, my fight, Juan Manuel Marquez in a fourth fight, but now some people are saying Marquez might have priced himself out. Um, what are your thoughts upon about hearing that news that Marquez might have priced himself out of a fourth fight with Pacquiao? Do they? I, I didn't. That's the rumor. It's nothing. I, I haven't honestly. I haven't been following anything about the boxing right now. Yeah. Anything about the industry of the boxing right now because I'm just really honestly focus on this fight okay. this is the first time i've been really focused on a fight since i won with uh costa and since uh, when i beat that on i was focusing really well when i fought of course i was focusing really well peterson same thing so this is the first time i'm not really paying attention to any outside uh about boxing this and that all these guys in your weight class you ready to fight them blah blah, blah. I'm not, honestly, I don't really know right now. Okay. I never heard nothing like that yet. I, like I said, I'm just focusing on Mike Alrado. I want to prove a point and show the world that what I can do. And just last thing, if you if you did have to make a prediction on Pacquiao Bradley rematch, do you feel Bradley could do something different in that fight, or I mean, any thoughts on the rematch? Uh, maybe I think Bradley might box him a little more, run around a little more, because when he did that and spent a couple rounds in the first fight. He was hurting, uh, he, he not hurting Pacquiao, but he was making Pacquiao frustrated. Yeah. So, you know, maybe he'll do that. Maybe he'll go back and look at tapes and do that. So, you know, honestly, I don't really know. Uh, like I said, best luck to both guys. Okay, man. Thanks a lot, Brad.